Today we're celebrating one of the most important days in the history of our country. The day when ordinary people, against all odds, stood up for what was right and fought for their freedom. That's right, Joss, and that's why this week on The Malefet we're choosing gaming's top five revolutionaries who also went against the odds and taught us how small things can start a chain reaction that can bring about big changes. At number five, Tyr McDowell from Suikoden. Reluctant at first, Tyr soon proves to be an able hero and gets the support of various groups of people, gains valuable alliances, and eventually conquers their enemies even at a high cost for tier. And at number 4, Barrett and Avalanche from Final Fantasy VII. Deciding he should go Captain Planet on Shinra's corporate butt, Barrett and his eco-freedom fighters hit the gold mine for their cause when they get Square's poster boy Cloud on their roster. And number 3, Gordon Freeman from Half-Life. If his name doesn't inspire you to fight for freedom, then maybe his crowbar will. Despite having the choice of simply sleeping everything off, Gordon still fights the good fight to free the world from the Combine. At number 2, Jim Rayner from StarCraft. If you think you're having a bad day, just be thankful you're not having a bad Jim Rayner level day. With only a handful of loyal troops against an evil empire, warmongering aliens, and backstabbing allies, Jim Rayner maintains his push for freedom one day at a time. And for our number one freedom fighter, Blaskovich from Wolfenstein 3D. If you think nothing can be more evil than Adolf Hitler and his Nazi party, why don't you try Robo Hitler and a demon infested Reich? Regardless of the ridiculous odds of surviving, Blaskovich, with nothing more than an army knife to start the ball rolling, helped put an end to World War II and kept the world from being overrun by goose stepping undead zombies. 